hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you Ooh. hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you guys are new my name is crystal patrice so as you can see by the title we are going to be cleaning my car and doing like a revamp um with some i'm adding some new little characteristics of myself into my car so I did one of these videos before last year um so i'm doing it again this year so with spring and summer coming um i definitely wanted to add a little bit of something um in my car so with that being said continue to watch so guys i'm pretty much going to be showing you um some of my fav favorite uh actual cleaning products that i like to use for my car and also i'm going to be um using some new stuff well, it's not really new, but it's some stuff that I didn't show in my last video. Um, but first, we're going to just wipe down my car. And after that, we're going to add in some of the new stuff that I've recently purchased. So some of the products that I like to use um, are these Almorol. One is cleaning and one is per uh, protectant. So I like to use this one first and then go over it with this one. Although you can pretty much use any one, honestly, but I just like to use both. Um, I do have a duster that I use because I like to wipe my car down first before I go ahead and clean it with the cleaner and protectant. I had to buy some more of this but i like to use these because i do i'm sorry i like to use this because i do have cloth seats so i do use some uh fabric spray this one specifically is the fab uh, febreze fabric april fresh and i like to spray my seats down with this so i'm gonna just let y'all kind of see what my car is looking like right now um yeah <laughs> okay guys so this is my car right now this is my box of treats this is what my floor looks like so no one's usually in the car with me so it's pretty much like my side that's mostly like especially the floor mostly that's dirty um every now and again i may have a passenger but I don't really focus too much on the back because, again, like I said, no one's in my car but me. Um, so, my main focus really is going to be with the front part of my car. So, let's get into some cleaning, some spring cleaning at that.
this is what my stair wheel and all of this is looking like. Nice and clean. So what I'm gonna do is do both these doors and then Okay guys, so I'm gonna just go ahead and put my um, steering wheel on. So let me just explain to y'all. So my car is very minimalist. I really don't like a lot of flashy things or I don't like my car to be super busy. So I'm mad I didn't say this in the beginning, but my car is gonna be very minimalistic. It's just the fact that I'm gonna be putting a little personality in here just a little something here and there i'm not really going over the top so if that's something you still want to continue to look into or look at definitely continue to keep watching so i think what i want to do is go ahead and just put the different things in my car then i'm going to go vacuum uh my floors because it's just a lot going on and I don't want to keep moving the box all over the place. So I'm definitely just going to go ahead and just start putting the stuff in the car. So I wanted the Winnie the Pooh thing. <laughs> That's my favorite character. But I couldn't find things that pretty much match because I kind of want my color, color scheme to kind of go with each other. But that wasn't the case. So um, I decided to kind of use like a lavender or like you know use like lavender accent color so that's something you're gonna see within my car and different things that i'm gonna show y'all in this video but yeah we're gonna go ahead and get into this stern wheel i did get i like black i like to keep it matching my seats and everything but it does have this peak of purple so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on This is it. I probably should have opened this yesterday just so it can kind of stretch. But here we are, so it's okay. So. I hope this fits my style. So this is what my steering wheel is looking like. I love this purple. So I did find some cute Winnie the Pooh coasters. So my thing last year was kind of like paw print color. So this is what I have here. So I'm gonna say this next time just in case I want to switch back over my car. But I um I did find these cute Winnie the Pooh coasters. They look like this. This is what they look like. I can probably Keep this and put the old ones in there. So I did get a neck pillow for when I'm driving just for, you know, extra comfortability and when I'm in traffic coming from the city. So I already took it out the packet because it was kind of vacuum sealed. So I just wanted to make sure that it was fluffed out. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in here.
this feels pretty comfortable. Yeah, we taking these off. Football season is over with. I don't know, but these braids, it's kind of <laughs> in the way. But this feels very comfortable. So, I like it. I like it. So, I did get a... Um, what is this? <laughs> I did get this um, mount for... Um, my rear view mirror. Honestly, honestly, I haven't gotten comfortable with like the mount that I did buy for my camera. For some reason, I don't know if I'm doing it wrong or what the case is, but it's just not working out for me. So honestly, and it's so com it's so convenient to still record with my camera. So. There you have it. Let's take this off. So I'm gonna just set this up and then I'll be right back. this is what it's looking like um but i don't like it because i can't adjust my mirror <laughs> so to what i can see so this is not gonna work i'm gonna have to get the one that go on the actual mirror i mean the windshield because this don't work for me so if anybody else can use this, just let me know in the comments below and I'll send it to you because this is just not working for me. So I did buy this window seatbelt. Oh, shit. So I did buy this window and seatbelt um, emergency hammer. So I kind of like this one better than the other ones I've seen because this one is more sleeker. It's, it's just my vibe. It looks like this. I just want something that's just sleek and different. So what I do love, they do give you one of these so you can kind of test it. So I do like that, but I'm probably not gonna do it cause I'm kind of like scared. So we gonna see. I'm scared. Yeah, my phone keeps overheating, but I do love this. And this is where you would just pull out and cut your seatbelt. And I like how they have this little safety thing so you don't have to worry about poking or cutting yourself. Um, they do give you um, some glass, a piece of glass that you can test this out with. I've seen it in the videos um, on Amazon. So if you want to see that, you can go ahead to that. I don't want to do it because I don't, I'm scared that <laughs> glass is going to pop in my car. And I don't want that issue. But they do show it on the Amazon. So that's what you want to see. You can go there. But I love this. It's so sweet. And you can just hang it anywhere. You can hang it on your keychain. Me personally, I'm most likely going to put it in um, somewhere in my console area just for quick fast reaching 
So, yeah. But this is so cute. So, one thing I do need to clean out is my armrest here. Um, stuff is just, like, really all over the place. Um, it's really not organized. Um, everything. So, I'm going to just go ahead and just try to, like, clean that out real quick. Oh, and I did buy a organizer just to allow me to have more space and then be able to reach certain things better so this is what it looks like for my vehicle and you can set it up it has a spot where you can put your change things like that so i'm gonna set this up and then i'm gonna show y'all what it looks like okay guys so i did get this pouch from amazon as well and it's just to, again to keep everything organized in my console so what i do have in here is um my room spray i have my lens cleaner for my glasses some mouthwash i have um a little um first aid kit um some kleenex i have some pins this is for my tire pressure so i can check my tire pressure um i do have some visine in here and some straws i'm probably most likely going to add a little more things but this is pretty much like all i have right now and this, this is the cutest little pouch and i'm gonna just put that in here so this is what it's looking like Then, um, and this is what I have in my, um, ooh, and this is what I have in my organizer. I have, um, some gloves because I use these when I, um, go to the gas station. I have my work badge. I have some, also some blunt spray. I also use this as a fragrance for my car. I have my uh, lanyard for my car at work. Um, I have a pen, because at least I like a pen just to be handy. Um, I have some change that I just put in there. And I have two types of lip glosses. I have a chapstick and a lip gloss. And that's what I'm going to put here. So... This looks so nice. Oh, forgot my glasses case. So that can go under here as well. And I'm gonna also put this here as well on the side for now. And I'm gonna put this here as well. That's up and set. So I did buy some new hooks for my car as well because these, I don't like these because they always seem to unhook themselves, fall off, be in the floor in the back seat. So I found these instead. And then whoever's in the back, they can use it as a phone holder, watch something on their phone something for the kids if you want to set the kids up with something they can watch on their phone this turns into a phone holder for them so it comes with two here so what i'm going to do is put one on the passenger seat and one on my seat and this is what they look like they so much better i don't have to worry about them falling down or anything like that And this is how it turns into a phone holder. So that's pretty cool. And just snaps back on. So this is what it looks like.
And I'm just put the other one in. Matter of fact, I think I'm gonna just put both on the passenger side because I I don't want it to affect the pillow. So so I'm gonna just leave that for now until I can figure out how I'm gonna set it up behind me because I do want one behind me. So, um, and I did buy some wet ones that I'm gonna keep in my door as well. Sorry for this bad angle, y'all. But when I first time I put it up here, my phone just, I guess the sun is making it die or whatever. But I did get a new key set. This isn't the color. This looks totally different from the color that's online. Um, but we're just going to go ahead and go with it anyway. So this is what my keys look like now. I couldn't really find this is a old um, key fob cover I'm gonna take this off and just have my regular key fob because I seem to can't find anything that's going with the scheme that I want this pretty much I'm over that but this is the newest one so I'm gonna put this on it and I'm gonna show you what it looked like Y'all, if y'all get keys like this, always try to keep these things because these will come loose at some point. Okay, guys, so this is how my new keys look now. I just need to clean this off, but this is what it looks like. You know, I'm a Dallas Cowboys fan house key grocery store um this is my godson he passed away um about to be two years now so i just like to keep this on my keychain elijah but, so my key is looking like i did buy some air vent clips um, I have these, um, Febreze ones, and then I have this Yaki candle one. I think I'm gonna just go ahead and use this one. I'm gonna probably put this in my glove compartment. I mean, in my armrest. Since it's two in here, I'm just gonna go ahead and use both of them. got that in so we don't put everything up y'all like i said this is very minimalistic so if that's the word minimalist whatever <laughs> so i do want to show you guys um Hold on, let me put this back on my mirror. Okay. Gotta keep that in here.
Okay, so like I said, we're pretty much finished all of the decorating or you know putting stuff in the car. So I did buy a new vacuum because the vacuum I feel like that I currently do have, I feel like it don't suck right. So I did buy a new one. And this is the Marlboro car vacuum cleaner. So yeah, I can smell these things already and the car isn't even on. But what I love about this is that it cleans up or sucks up wet and dry stuff. Um, which I love comes with a hose for those far to reach areas so I'm gonna test this out the reviews were really good on Amazon for this product so hopefully I can say the same once I try it comes with a brush to clean the carpet And this is it. Nice, sleek. Very nice and sleek. This is the core, so you can charge this up and use it um, handheld, or you can use it as it's plugged up. Um, that's the option is yours. does have the instructions so I'm gonna just put all of this other stuff in the trash recycle bin and then just the it's just a lot going on up here so I'm gonna have to get myself situated Nicole is very long, so you can definitely hit the back. So let's try it out. Hey guys, so this is my carpet after cleaning. It still look a little dusty. Most likely I'm probably just gonna go ahead and wash them, but it did a pretty good job. Pretty much so. The final touches is pretty much going to be me spraying down my car again. I'm gonna be using this fabric spray. This is um, Febreze. So.
guys that's pretty much how i like to keep my car nice and fresh and clean i love a clean car again i will have every product that i did show you guys listed in the description box below so definitely check that out for that and that's it so guys i will see you in my next video bye